Yes, I'm Clone Network has been re-released. Currently it is whitelisted, but it will be coming back up soon, and we are going to be doing a quick review on the Clone Network. Hey there guys, MCP here, and today we are going to be doing some Minecraft Pocket Edition in review. Now, if you guys have been watching my channel for quite a while, probably around 8 months, you may know where we are right now, you may be recognizing this spawn, and that is because we're in the one, the only, Infernal Network. Yes, Infernal Network has been re-released, currently it is whitelisted, but it will be coming back up soon, and we are going to be doing a quick review on Infernal now, again, this will be extremely quick. Uh, you guys have seen the version 1 of Infernal um, Network PE, and then the official one, and then uh, Beta PC. So you guys probably know a little bit about how this works. Um, so I'm going to be doing this really quickly. But since we last joined the server, uh, there has been a bunch of kits added. So if you do slash kit, you can see uh, now it's no longer just... Um, Weekly, Monthly, Warrior, Master, Mortal, and Overlord, and I think Divine. They added in Inferno, Reaper, Erez, Wizard, and I think they changed Daily to Apprentice. Um, so yeah, that's kind of how all the kits work. Uh, currently, I have on my uh, Immortal kit, and I also have some Wizard gear. I have both Wizard and Immortal in my inventory right now. Um, but... Yeah, uh, Immortals Prop 4, Wizards Prop 3, and you can see if you keep going, um, Mortal 5, Era 6, Reaper 7, Divine 8, Inferno 9, Masters 2, Warriors 1. And then, I would assume Monthly is probably like Unenchanted Diamond, Weekly is probably like Enchanted Iron, and then I would assume Apprentice is probably like Leather or something like that. Uh, so let's probably, we should probably show, uh, a little bit about the map. Now, right now, this is a work in progress, so, uh, these two warps over here do not work. As you can see, uh, Warp Cough is not working, and neither is Warp PvP. It seems that either Slapper, Slapper is disabled, or the Warps just haven't been made yet. It could be either of the two. Um, and also they haven't added any Vault plugins yet, uh, but they are going to be doing that soon. Uh, we do have Gen Buckets and a Slash Shop, uh, so if you want to Slash Shop, then... Very simple, just type in slash shop, and there's a spawner system in the slash shop uh, that ranges from, I believe it's chicken to iron golem. Yeah, chicken to iron golem. Blaze, zombie pigment, zombie, skeleton, sheep, and cow in the middle. And then we also have uh, gem buckets, which is, I believe, G something, slash G buy. That's it, G buy. I thought it was G shop. The slash G buy, you can get cobble gem buckets, sand gem buckets, and obsidian gem buckets. And you have to place it from up to down, so that basically means that uh, you place it like from the top going down if that makes any sense you aren't gonna place it on the ground place it like under a block anyways yeah now we should we, let me show off the map uh we do have a war zone here that is extremely similar to what the old war zone used to be now if you guys have played high forge you would probably recognize uh the spawn and this um Warzone, because they were both made by Goblin Builders, so they are very similar, and also if you played Cryptic or Brand PE, I didn't play Brand PE, but I did play Cryptic and I checked out Brand PE, uh, both of them had very similar spawns and Warzones as well, so they kind of matched up. Um, but yeah, it's it's pretty cool, I definitely like it a lot. Uh, it's a very large Warzone, and a, a pretty large spawn as well. Uh, so, yeah, that's, that's kind of how everything looks. If you want to, you can, uh, go over out these little corners, and you can parkour along the sides, so, like, you can see it, it sort of stops here, but you can still, uh, parkour through here, and see how the outside of the, uh, spawn looks, too, which is pretty good, to be completely honest. It's, it's pretty good spawn, um, but yeah. So, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed the review. It, I know it was very small, but I actually recorded a longer one, and my tablet died during it for whatever reason. So, you know, rip. Uh, but yeah, that's that's it. So I hope you all enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and peace.